A video is circulating online tonight of a Winnipeg police officer being questioned about not wearing a mask during a traffic stop. And the person behind the camera claims it turned what was just going to be a warning into a pricey ticket. CTV's Mike Arsenault is standing by with those details for us tonight. So Mike, why was this vehicle pulled over in the first place? Mary Lee, the almost $300 ticket was issued for failing to move into a farther lane when passing an emergency vehicle. But the passengers say the officer was defensive about the mask and the ticket was issued because they questioned him. I just have a question. Yeah. Why are you not wearing your mask and you're yelling? If you want to do that way, I'll just write a ticket. Is that the way you want to do no, this? I'm just Tuesday evening, a Winnipeg police officer pulled over the driver of this car. The woman recording the video says when the officer approached the window, he asked how long the driver had his license and lectured him about the rules of the road. Like he was yelling and like my initial concern was he wasn't wearing a mask because me and my boyfriend were both healthcare workers. The passenger, who didn't want to reveal her name as she's been getting harassed online, says she worried if she caught COVID-19 from the officer, she would bring the virus into the hospital. See, since it bothers you now, I put one on, but he's getting a ticket. So. Yeah, thank you, yeah. sir. The officer gave them a $298 ticket for failing to move into a farther lane when passing an emergency vehicle using emergency lamps or equipment. Associate Professor of Criminal Justice at the University of Winnipeg, Bronwyn Dobchuk Land says police officers are granted the power to act in ways they judge to be appropriate, and sometimes they can act offensively. Supposed oversight bodies like the IIU being unable to hold officers accountable for much more serious harms for this than this communicates to officers and, and creates a context in which they know that they likely won't be held accountable for this type of behavior. Wednesday, Mayor Bowman spoke about the traffic stop video and says he was disappointed with what he saw. Is asking a question of anybody who works for the city of Winnipeg about whether or not they're complying with provincial public health orders, um, I think is a fair question. In a statement to CTV, the Winnipeg Police Service says Winnipeg police officers are expected to wear face masks during interactions with members of the public unless social distancing is being practiced. The officer has been spoken to by his commanding officer about his conduct and the matter has been dealt with. The passenger doesn't think police officers should act the way the officer in the video did. I know the rules, like, he, and he's not exempted just because he's a police officer. As a matter of fact, he's the one that's supposed to be implementing it. The Winnipeg police say they aren't able to cancel a ticket and that decision is up to Manitoba prosecutions. The ticket has been flagged and efforts are being made to contact the driver. The woman plans on filing a complaint with Lyra, the law enforcement review agency. All right, thanks for this, Mike.